What is up, guys? Welcome to the Verse Crypto Channel, the most savage, degenerate crypto channel out there. My name is Chaos Chris, and I'll be your host today. From this video, smash that like button, hit the subscribe button, and turn on bell notifications so we keep you guys up to date with the latest, greatest news and information in the space. With that being said, let's hop right in this video. As always, we got another awesome video for all you degenerates today. Today, we're going to be talking about a project called Globiance. For those guys who don't know what Globiance is, it is a decentralized exchange launching on the XDC blockchain. So today we're going to talk a little bit about this project. Can you guys the mean, mean the cheese of what they have to offer and why we think this project could be very explosive in the upcoming uh, bull market in 2025? Keep in mind, this video is for entertainment and education purposes only. This is not financial advice. Please do your own research. And enough being said, let's take a little look at Ruski at Glo Globiance. So if you guys want to check out Globiance, go to Globiance.com. It'll bring up this really cool UI. It has some really great um, features. It's got this pink theme. Um, you know, the CEO is a very big influencer, especially in the XDC community. Now, you might be asking yourself, all right, so what's Globiance? So Globiance is basically a decentralized exchange, a centralized exchange, and also a protocol that offers um, stable coins that are going to be launching specifically for the XDC blockchain. So the best way to think about it is it's kind of like Coinbase, but it also has a side of it where it's decentralized. So if you don't want to go through them to, you know, set up an account and just buy the crypto on their own wallets, you can still connect your wallet and then do a decentralized exchange swap, which is a really cool, unique feature. And when this project starts to blow up, there's a good chance that Qcoin and all these major other major crypto platforms might have to adopt the same model to compete because this is something that a lot of people want to be involved. Um, it might sound kind of silly, like, you know, well, why don't, why don't they just make the entire protocol a decentralized exchange, just kind of like how they have with, you know, PancakeSwap and Uniswap and whatnot. That might be true. But one thing is, you know, a lot of traditional investors like the idea of having a bank, a company that will sit there and hold your funds and will be somewhat responsible for your funds. And this is going to, you know, bring in a lot of the older generation investors. The younger generation crypto investors are all about, you know, your own keys, your own wallet, blah, 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 yada, yada, yada. That's not always the case. Some people are not comfortable navigating through cryptocurrency, trying to store, trying to store the crypto in a hot or cold wallet. And so Globiance is giving you the best of both worlds, and it also allows them to onboard new users. Now, um, they're going to be launched. They have launched in the U.S., Australia. Uh, major European nations, a few Asian countries, pretty much almost every continent, they they are penetrating markets all across the board, which is absolutely awesome. And on top of like all the great features that they're going to be offering, they have their own coin that you can buy and stake for some juicy APR. So let's come down here. Uh, let's go to... All right, so let's start off with uh, payment solutions. So what's a great feature of Globiance is they actually have a contactless payment. XDC was mainly founded to, to replace the current SWIFT payment system and compete with like XRP and XL and whatnot. Now, Globiance actually made a really easy way to pay people in crypto using a QR code and very quick transaction time since the XCC blockchain has, I think it was 10,000 TPS, uh, TPS approval rate. So if you come down here, they have a really cool app where you can go through, do it. You can scan a QR code and send crypto, stable coins, whatever coin you want in a matter of seconds. Definitely really cool. Now the GBEX. So GBX is going to be the main exchange token. It's also the world's only deflationary exchange token, which is kind of hard to imagine. Qcoin is inflationary. You stake the token on the platform and then they pay out interest to you. Binance Smart Chain 
technically it is an exchange token, but not really. They have their own blockchain. So it, it's kind of like 50 50. So they're they're deflationary, but they do it through a profit model where a certain percentage of the profits, I believe it's 20 percent they make off of it is you used to buy a BNB and basically burn it all the way down to 100 million BNB. Now, the GBX is a revolutionary token, an exchange token combined with futures previous, previously only available in meme tokens until now. The deflationary design of GBX virtually melts away the total supply daily with every transaction. The increased volume on exchanges functions as an afterburner, in increasing the burn and rewards for each and every trade made on the various platforms around the world. So... Basically, um, to kind of break down the deflationary mechanism, every single transaction rewards GBAX holders using the GBAX tax and burn model. Whenever a user transfers GBAX, a 4% tax will be, be collected. 2% of those tokens are instantly burned and 2% are distributed back to GBAX holders. So basically, if you hold the token, you earn more tokens. You also have a defl deflationary mechanism. Now, this is kind of more of, uh, you know, a reflection token or like a meme token model. But ultimately, what gives the GBEX token utility is the fact that there's an exchange behind it. And you can earn um, lower, cheaper rates if you use the GBEX token to purchase other crypto. On top of that, they're going to be, a, be launched. This project is going to be on the XCC blockchain, which is a third generation blockchain. And it's also ISO 222 compliant. So you're basically getting the best of both wor worlds. But what gives GBEX the huge advantage is the fact that it's deflationary and the supply is going to decrease over time. So definitely a huge potential. So exchange, you come over here to exchange. You can, you can buy XDC. You can buy hundreds of different types of cryptocurrency. All you have to do is log in, KYC, you have your own account. Um, if there's a blockchain that you want to get onto, like, you know, Clayton or XCC or Algorand, you can use the Globe Binance Exchange to do that. Exchanges are really great for getting some initial uh, uh, crypto to launch onto a new blockchain, but they're not great for storing your crypto. I want to make that completely clear. But if you're not comfortable with having your own cold or hot wallet feel free to like you know use this exchange but do not put that much money on it and keep in mind you do not own that crypto so it is an option there for anyone who's new to crypto or anyone who doesn't feel confident in you know having your own crypto on your own wallet with your that you own the keys to now the coolest part the decentralized exchange globiance has a dex where if you want to do some swaps on the XCC network, you can come over here, swap for the GBEX token, swap for the XSwap token, swap for any ecosystem token will be offered on this decentralized exchange. It is an option. All you have to do is connect your wallet. You do not have to have an account or whatnot. It is completely decentralized. What Whatever you want to do, you can just do it through this decentralized exchange, which is absolutely really cool. And I think it's going to be great, a, a great format for future uh, centralized exchanges. Staking. So if you guys own some of those Global Alliance tokens or your GBEX, your GBEX tokens, you can actually do a time lock stake and earn up to 10% APY as much as 12 months and 4% APY as little as one month. I absolutely love this. Hex has been the one project that has done time lock stakes, and there's a few other projects are that are rep, are uh, doing this model as well. But Globe, GBX is doing the same exact model as a way to earn some juicy APY on top of that. Keep in mind, there's also a deflationary mechanism behind this token, so it is going to be deflationary, but you can still earn some juicy API, APY with that token being locked up. This also increases the def deflationary component increases the deflationary component of GBEX because more tokens are going to be taken off the market and locked up into these time lock stakes. So it's a win-win for everybody. And also keep in mind, we're at a bear market. So if you guys want to purchase this token, this might be the time to do it now. And you can also earn some awesome APYs on top of it. So on top of 
payment solutions, DEXs, tokenomics. They have a card that you can use to spend your crypto. Pink, black, gold, and mint cards. These cards are going to be really, really great. It's going to be the future of our financial system where you have a card with all your crypto on it and you can select which crypto you want to use or just automatically goes through, converts it to a stable coin, sends it to the merchant. The merchant accepts it. You are good to go. And GPX is already on top of it, implementing these cool card designs. And it's very similar to uh, crypto.com and what they do with their own little card as well. So really cool. And I see this as a really big competitor with Crypto.com and Coinbase. Now, the one thing I'm very excited about, stable coins, baby. So starting off, Globinds, a global financial services headquartered in Singapore, launches a mass market Singapore dollar and euro backed stable coin. They basically went through and, and looked at all the major stable, stable coins or fiat currencies from the euro to usd to uh the singapore dollar and they created these stable coins so that, so that you can onboard more users into cryptocurrency and also it can be used as a way for anyone within the xcc uh blockchain to take some profits during this upcoming um bull market um each of these stable coins is pegged to a native fiat currency and because they're offering this in so many different other currencies, there's a good chance that they're going to try to get every single fiat currency across the world, if possible. And this is going to be a great way to onboard people in different markets, but also spread awareness of this cryptocurrency project. So it's absolutely brilliant. I love this setup with it right now. So that's a little bit of a breakdown behind the products. Now, I want to go into the roadmap because I saw something very interesting. And after this, I'm going to wrap up this video. I don't want this video to be too long. So we just got through quarter one through three, you know, stable coins, they're staking, yada, yada, yada. Now coming up in quarter four, I'm not going to go through every single one of the one of these things, but some big things they have coming, a cross exchange DEX. So they want to do a, a decentralized exchange where you can swap tokens from the Binance Smart Chain over to the XCC blockchain or the Ethereum blockchain over to the XCC blockchain. So what they're trying to do is create an interoperability feature that will not only benefit XDC, but also introduce us into the interoperability age, which I expect is going to hit really, really hard in 2025. So this is something big that they're coming with. And if you ever want to get into a new blockchain or you want to you know, get a special coin that's going to take a little bit of a minute to get to, you can utilize this cross decentralized exchange. Keep in mind, it is a DEX. So it's going to be decentralized, meaning you do not have to go through centralized exchange and get KYC'd and go through that whole caboodle. You can do the cross DEX. Also, NFT marketplace, they're getting into NFTs. A lot of people don't like NFTs. I, I kind of like them when they have utility, but ultimately this is an industry that's not going to go away. And the fact that they're diversified in NFTs, absolutely awesome. So kind of going down, um, kind of going to the future. Um, you know, the one big thing I also want to mention is, you know, the markets that they're getting into, UAE, Hong Kong, Malaysia, Japan, Korea, Thailand, Indonesia. What do all these markets have in common? They are some of the biggest financial markets in the world, right next to the US, the European nations, the Western world. They're trying to get this token in every continent, in every country, spread awareness, because when XCC blows up, this token is going to blow up right with it. So kind of coming back, guys, that's a little bit of wrap up. I want to give you guys a quick introduction. My overall thoughts uh, on Glo uh, on, uh, Globiance. It is a phenomenal project. By combining a centralized exchange with a decentralized exchange is absolutely brilliant. In case, you know, crypto regulations come in, they will have the ability to apply for a bit license, but also they can still maintain investor confidence for those of you who do not want to go through centralized exchange. You can go through a decentralized exchange. On top of that, they have stable coins and multiple fiat currencies, and they have a plan to have an NFT marketplace and 
a cross blockchain decentralized exchange, which would be astronaut astronomically huge. What Globalize is doing is they're trying to put their hand in every single market and make their product extremely um, profitable and also marketable. In my opinion, I think this project is going to be the backbone of XCC, and it's going to be one of the few projects that's going to onboard so many users from other blockchains. So you guys definitely want to keep your eye on this blockchain, especially for the upcoming bull market. And there's a good chance it's going to do some pretty sweet numbers. So that's it for the video today, guys. Um, comment down below. Let me know if you have any questions about Globiance or let me know if you want me to do a uh, technical analysis on, on the current price of the token or go into some more details of this project. And before I wrap this video up, smash that like button, hit the subscribe button, turn on notifications so we keep you guys up to date with the latest, greatest news and information in the space. My name is Kyle Chris. I love every single one of you guys. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.